Hello, myself is Rati and today I will perform the week 5 experiment of EEC lab. So this is our circuit diagram of the circuit. First we use BJT and a base terminal is connected to a potentiometer of 1 kilo ohm. Then further potentiometer is connected to a 2.5 volt voltage from a 1000 E and to the ground. Now this C point means connector is connected to 1 kilo ohm resistor and then through channel A of a 1000 kit and E emitter to the ground. So we have made the circuit using the diagram. Now we will measure the IB current using multimeter. So we have set the IB current to 0.1 milliampere. Now we will measure the VBE. Our VBE is nearly 0.58 volt. These all parameters means IB and VBE are at 5 volt voltage supply from an 1000 kit. Now we will measure the VCE means voltage between connector and emitter using multimeter at 5 volt. So at 5 volt it has nearly about 0.1 nearly about 0.12 volt. Now we measure our current IC and the current IC is about 2.99. Now we will measure our IC and VCE at a 4 volt voltage supply from a 1000 kit and then at 3 volt then at 2 volt then at 1 volt and then at 0 volt and and take our readings note down our readings and make a graph. So these are the readings we have taken. Uh, these are the readings of VCE means voltage between connector and emitter. This, these are the readings of IC current in milliampere and this is the graph we get of the by plotting the values of VCE and IC our IB value is 0 0.1 milliampere and VB value is 0.58 volt now we will perform BJT driver circuit and our circuit is look like this our BJT is emitter is grounded and base is connected to 5 kilo ohm register and then the further 5 kilo ohm register is connected to potentiometer and our collector is connected to the LED further LED is connected to 200 ohm register and then to channel A. Now we will provide 5 volt voltage. Now we have provided 5 volt voltage from a 1000 kit using channel A. Now we will measure the VAC when the LED is off. As you can see, the VAC when the LED is off is nearly about 0 0.57. Now we also measure the IB current when LED is off. As we can see, our IB current is 0 when LED is off. Now we gradually increase the potentiometer and see what happens. As we can see, our LED is start glowing. Now our LED is glowing at their extreme brightness. Now we again measure our VCE voltage when LED is on. As you can see our VCE when LED is on is nearly about 0.12. Now we will measure our IB current when LED is glowing. Now as we can see our IB current when LED is on is 0 0.01 milliampere. Now we have replaced our BJT2 MOS transistor whose first terminal is connected to potentiometer, second terminal is connected to LED, then further LED is connected to uh, 200 ohm resistor, then this further to channel A and third terminal is connected to the ground. Now we will provide a 5 volt voltage supply from Adam 1000 kit and measure the Now we will measure our VDS means voltage across drain and source and as you can see while our LED is off our drain and source voltage is nearly about 0.99 something. Now we gradually increase our voltage and see as you can see our LED is start glowing. Now our LED is start glowing 
uh, their extreme brightness and the VDS is uh, nearly 2.66 about. So these are the readings of PC and IB of the uh, BJT when the LED is on and when the LED is off and these are the readings of VDS and IG uh, of MOS. As you can see that uh, MOS required uh, um, no current from gate to bright the LED but in BGS it's required some amount of current from gate. The VC is, is small but the VDS is large. So now we have connected a LDR to the base terminal of BJT and further it is connected to channel A. All other connections are same. Now we provide a 5 volt voltage using a 1000 kit. So our LED is blinking and when we put a shadow at LDR our LED stops blinking. Now we measure the VCE when the LED is blinking. As we can see this is our voltage when our LED is blinking. Now as we touch LDR our voltage is increases.